Alright y'all, so welcome back to my channel. Let me tell y'all something. First of all, y'all know I'm always big cap. I'm always saying like, yeah, we finna be up with the tube and we never up with the tube. But y'all, guess what? Your girl wanna got herself a little camera or whatever the case may have been. And now, guess where her phone at? Right here. Oh, don't ain't that cute? Look at that. Ah! <laughs> so today we're gonna be talking about we're not even gonna be talking, but we're gonna do New York slings. Why? Because I've been wanting to do a video about New York slang. Because I feel like a lot of people be like, oh, I love New Yorker accents and then as a New Yorker you always like bro what accent like what was you talking about but without further ado let's get right into this sh video so the first slang is dead ass <laughs> now when you hear somebody say dead ass the thing about dead ass is like it has mad meanings so they could be like oh you dead ass serious which is like a question which is like bro like are you serious right now like bro what like yeah it's just like bro you serious right now or you could be like arguing with a person and they like dead ass and when they say dead ass it's like dead ass like you for real like really or it could be like dead ass bro like dead ass when somebody say dead ass like dead ass bro they're basically saying like bro like no exaggerations bro like yes bro like yes bro like so it's like say you and your friend talking and you like bro like boom 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 like for me it was the strength your friend gonna be like dead ass you're gonna be like dead ass bro <laughs> so it's like that um the second slang is basically gonna be brick um when a new yorker say brick it's really not that hard to figure out what it means but honestly you're really gonna hear people say brick in the winter time because brick basically refers to it being cold outside like it's brick so yeah it's like you know when they be like oh like yeah, not even, because I was going to be, like, raining cats and those. But, no, like, brick basically means, like, it's it's just cold. Like, it's brick. Um, the next slang is going to be YKTV. <laughs> YKTV basically means you know the vibes. You know the vibes. So, when a person says YKTV, basically think of it in terms of, like, it's, like, say it's a Friday night. And your friend hit you up and they're like, yo, we outside. You'd be like, YKTV, like, you know the vibes. Like, you already know. Like, it's big, we outside. That's YKTV for me. Basically, like, you know the vibes. You already know what's up. The next thing, y'all, is going to be wcw which really ain't even like slang. It's just like, what's the word? Like, what we're side? Like, what we doing? So, basically, Friday night. You mad boy, you in the crib, you gonna write your friend WTW, like, what is the vibes? Like, niggas said, what's the vibe? Like, what's the word? Like, what are we doing? Like, what's the word? Like, I'm trying to be outside, not inside. Like, what? So, the next slang is basically going to be, damn, you know what's crazy? Yo. Nah, well, I was about to say the word and it came to me. Next slang going to be tough. Like, tough, basically, you know what's crazy? I feel like tough could also be like, yo, that feel tough. Like, but honestly, like, thinking about it in my head, like, I've never heard nobody in New York say, yo, that feel tough. So don't go around trying to tell people, like, yo, that feel tough because they're going to look at you like, my nigga, what? Like, what is you talking about? But tough basically mean, like, damn, like, you're dead dread like that's tough like like it's just like i don't know what to tell you like that's tough like that's that tough 
like it's tough like <laughs> tough basically means tough like damn like wouldn't want to be you that's tough but that's tough like like you know what's tough what the makeup artist just texted me that's tough like if you was if you wasn't in my situation you was on the outside looking in you would that be like damn bro that's tough like that's tough the next thing dread like if you're dread that basically just means like you dread like like you could say that you dread so it's like bro i'm dread right now or somebody could be like yo i know you're dread so dread perfect example of dread i just hit my hand on the wall <laughs> it's like say you had a party put on for me nice fit looking for mm, mm, for me and then you get there bro somebody got on the same fit as you bro you're dread like you're tight you tight like i know you're dread because if i was you i would be dumb dread like literally dread again with the makeup on just testing me i'm dread <laughs> i'm laughing about it y'all because in life you really cannot do nothing but laugh because like what can you really do? I don't even know. Oh my god, cap. Cap is another New York slang. Because honestly, niggas be big cap. Let me tell you what cap is. Cap, this is how you gonna use cap for me in your your town. When somebody, somebody look at you and they be like, oh yeah, like, I was just on a yacht with 50 Cent and Drake. But you know they lying. Just look at them and be like, big cap. Like, that's what, like, nigga, you're a big cap. Like, shut up. Like, you're a big cap. Big and cap. Like, F out of here. Like, you're a big cap. Oh, my God. Tight is dead another New York slang. But I feel like people don't even really be using that a lot right now. But, like, it's still so, it's so embedded in New York culture that, like, you dead just be like, tight. But tight is fake, like, another way of saying dread. Like, it's just like... Bro, like, I'm tight right now. Like, yeah, like, you just mad. You upset. You angry. Like, you pissed off. Basically, is like, how we use tight. Yeah, I, I ain't never heard nobody say your fit is tight, this, that, and the third. Honestly, I would have told y'all that Trevish is a New York slang, but people be using Trish now. Getting me tight. Like, but Trish was a New York way of saying, like, that. Basically, like, she a hoe. Like, she a Trish! Ah! Like, she give big Trish vibes. Like, she's a big Trish. Like, massive Trish in the kind of that soul. Big fucking Trish. You know what's crazy? No, because I really have to say this, too. The city is also slang. Because if you're from New York City... I kid you not, the city is Manhattan. Like, the city is the city. Like, nobody who literally lives in Brooklyn calls Brooklyn the city. Nobody who lives in the Bronx calls that shit the city. Like, the city only refers to Manhattan. But it's like, if you go upstate and stuff, they call all five boroughs the city. So it's like, kid you not, when I started going to Albany for school, like, I started referring to Brooklyn as, oh yeah, the city. But then when I would go home to Brooklyn, I would refer to Manhattan as the city. So it's like that shit might throw you off a little bit, but when you get to the five boroughs, you will start to realize that people within the four boroughs call Manhattan only the city. Literally. No, dumb is another New York slang. How I forgot about dumb and I dead be saying that. Dumb and wild. They go like hand in hand, like they're dead interchangeable. Cause you could be like, that's dumb tight. Like, not even that's dumb tight, but like I'm dumb tight. Or you be like, I'm wild tight. It's just an exaggeration. Like, you're just over-exaggerating what you are. Like, you know New York is always over-exaggerating or whatever the case may happen. So, it's just like... Nah, but you know what's not over-exaggeration? I kid you not. When you say somebody's wild, ugly, or dumb, ugly, bro, like... That's where it's never exaggeration. Because it's like, bro, like, if you're dumb, ugly, you're dead ugly. Like, that's what That's what the... <laughs> Yo, that's really fucked up. Like, 
yes honestly y'all my camera finna die so the last slang that i'm gonna give y'all for today is gonna be b like you bugging b you wildin b i don't know The battery died.